Hi, welcome to my new system here. What are we on? This is quite uh, different than we're used to. This is an Arch Merged, a budgie kind of desktop. And I've set some things already, new icons and all that, but it's a clean installation. So it's the ISO of Arch Merged that I've used. And I've installed already the scripts that are on the GitHub, on Arch Merge Linux or Linux. And um, this is my information of the system. And if we go and analyze how fast that is, it's in 2.5 seconds that everything is finished. The startup is finished. What did I do? Let's have a look. Um, so the system, you'll see that it's hovering over it. So you can open it. That's not standard. So what did I do? There, you should remember this little icon here, this bell. And there you have some information, as you can see, uh, about your system. But that's not important. I never change anything here. I go in here. And that's the budget desktop settings. Now, before I go any further, I have to explain to you already now, I want to do it now, that like um, Arch Merch is, um, is counting on XFCE, open box is counting on XFCE elements to be a proper full blown desktop environment. The same applies to Budgie. Budgie expects GNOME to be there, otherwise it will be very, very empty thing. Do it, you'll see. You'll give me, well, uh, say I'm right. So we have two things. We have the Budgie desktop settings that we should take a look at. So I took our darker and that's why when we click here now, it looks like this, but if we take our dark, then it's going to look like that. And if we're going to take arc, it's going to look like this. So it's a choice. A choice you make here. I'm going to take our dark to end with. And that's that. Icons, I took e-papyrus, -papy but I have Numix light, circle light, paper, papyrus. Uh, the side the icons, I can choose whatever I want. So leave it at one of those and everything changes. Then a lot of things here you can make it a little bit bigger. Desktop, desktop icons, you like it or you hate it. Uh, fonts, I didn't change anything. I rather like the Nottle Sans, also the Mac font. Lucida is also a very good tip. And then some Windows stuff, uh, what you want to do. But here I changed things. So I changed the name, so it's up here. And now it's not up there. It's whatever you want, but I want to show you, of course, in the screenshots what it is. And here's the rollover mouse. So if you don't say rollover mouse, doesn't look that nice. I have to click and we click enough already. So rollover mouse and lots of things. So this is uh, this is the panel. This we're talking about this thing. And we can say to this panel as well, settings, go to the bottom. I had it on like, I don't know few minutes and I said no 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 going back up <laughs> so it's up to you where you put it it's all good for me and this is a nice tip dock mode is quite nice so if you like uh, that one you keep that one that's up to you create a new panel so if you say the plank you always nice Eric and all that but why not create a new panel and then put everything on there all the icons of all the applications fine by me Auto start. I did decide to have variety already, and variety can be so awesome as to provide, I don't know, if there are interesting wallpapers already there, maybe this one would be nice. So, do we have Control Alt Arrow to the right? We have. So, we have different desktops as well. And uh, there you go. So, that's that. When you go into GNOME, there are some tips I can share you there. Oh, that's a nice one. Let's try that one. Oh yeah, that's a nice one. A little bit. Looks like it's Photoshop, but it's not. It's just a window, different colors. Great idea. So, okay, Bluetooth is there, backgrounds, notifications, search, region and language, universal, online, privacy, sharing, sound, and then power, blank screen and all that. Network is there, devices are there. That's a good tip. Here are your shortcut keys. Just made one for myself, Ctrl Alt T, Termite. The display, I broke my system because I have a dual monitor, I said to the system, mirror it for this video. And uh, okay, that's later, I have again, two monitors. 
Um, so the devices is quite, well, you have to click on this, that one and scroll down and see the details because in the details there's the default applications and that is something we want to change. So there you go. Um, that's all I did, I think. Uh, a wallpaper, some icons, some colors. I have a feeling that it's very fast. Um, so do try it out. It's Arch Merged, this one. And then we, uh, we install a little, you get a little folder and coming from Arch Merch Linux. It's all documented on archmerch.com. And all we do is I installed LightDM. I know if there's still an issue with GDM, but um, this one works. And then we started just going up like so till here, till here. And I stopped there. This is the personal stuff. You can install personal folders and all that. So that's more of um, personal choice of colors and uh, if you have problems reading Firefox when you a Firefox user sometimes the text fields are become becoming unreadable and that's just CSS so we have a little script here that says look Firefox we want to have colors and um, we have here this user content CSS that just says show me the text so okay <coughs> Uh, do enjoy it and that's of course uh, first uh, intention learnings is later but have fun and enjoy the system cheers